Greetings, I am Peller Nexus, the Ancient Gladiator, and today we're playing more Hall of Cure. Uh, the new update dropped uh, yesterday, and I already unlocked some characters. If you're new to the game, there's choosing your character with their stats and their weapon and their special. Um, there's Hollow House where you can go. Go wander a bit. You can harvest food and then go plant some more. Buy more stuff. Plant soil seed confirm. Various talents will uh, show up. Just hang around. Manage. Okay. Oh, their food demands will change too, apparently. shrimp potato and collect the money that you get and go hire more people I like that they use the uh, the various um, names that were submitted to the data um, Thing. There's fishing. There's buying stuff for your house. There's buy new uh, rods. There's cooking. Hey, it's me. <laughs> uh, love those guys. Anyway. Oh, there you are. Feed. Confirm. Okay. And they level up and stuff. Oh. Shrimp. Thank you, Mel. And then apparently they're planning for something this way. So I'll have to wait and see. Uh, there's the usual buying stuff. There's the leaderboard, there's the achievements, fandoms. Yeah. <laughs> but most of all, it's the game. Go fancy Kira. Cleared, cleared, cleared. Okay, I tried this last time and wait, use food. Oops. Alright. Not sure how much food will help. Settings, skills, start maxed out. Thank goodness. No stamps. Uh, no clubs. Alright. And this is the new area with um, 
identity uh, from hollow ID. Yeah, I'm just so freaking happy this. This is on like Steam now, and just deal with the upgrades and and all that easier. This thing is a pain in the ass because I've gotten caught on it and it's gotten me killed. I'm gonna explore the. Area looks like the Minecraft uh, setting that was built. Yeah, I'm keeping a close eye on my little CPU thing over in, th in the corner of OBS. I was like, let's let's see if if it, if this kills my computer or not. It's times like these, I'm glad the freaking pixel scar for my laptop isn't in a location that would, you know, block the gameplay. Check the other side. There's a lot of stuff to get caught up on in this map. It's kind of Kind of a pain. It is nice looking. It's not claustrophobic like the freaking know, castle one. Well, it's, it's cool and shit, but it's kind of a pain. And if you can hear my fan, uh, It really cannot be helped. It is just too too hot in here. Yeah, maximum sword power. Well, as soon as possible. Ooh. Sorry, right, crossing the fire. I mean, I'm going to be moving anyway, so. Hey. Increase pickup range. Yeah. Yep. Massively increase pickup range. I know, I know, I need to get back to Baldur's Gate 2 and Morrowind, but sometimes just simple, uh, kind of simple stuff like this is more fun to me. All weapons. Let's see if I can do this without needing any extra weapons. Gonna be hard as hell. But why not take up the challenge? Yeah, I'll deal with these peeps. Oh, that's right, that's the freaking limit of the Map.
But yeah, it's kind of why I've been finding stuff like this or Soul Blazer to be more what I want to do. Just let me put thought into the role playing side of this, the game. It's like, uh. Uh, I've never really felt like good at role playing. I'm gonna see if I can do this without any extra weapons, just just for the challenge of it. I think the last time I did any kind of game where I had to play a, as a role and I actually really enjoyed it was 316 Carnage Amongst the Stars. Sergeant Harrison, the fell out low patience sergeant that went for all of two missions and then got fragged by their own soldier throwing a grenade taking out the last um, opponent When the hell did I buy the the copy that I got like what, last year? I think. That's just that's just kind of a fun fun little game. And then there's the the initial rules for the game that were made as part of a contest that are still available online. Letters worth checking out, I think. I always like having this opportunity when the game's sort of paused to like take a drink or stretch. <sighs> That's a neat little mascot, the little painter of sorts. What if I, <laughs> I speaking of mascots, what if I had one? I feel like it would be kind of uh, cocky for me to come up with something that I haven't really earned. It's like... It's 
like I don't have I don't really have a, a fan base as it seems I mean I've got I've only got um, my YouTube subscribers and whoever's following me on Twitter these days. supporter dudes are a giant pain in the butt. Nah. Swap. Firm. Strengthen. Okay. Still, it's kind of like the whole silly merch idea of videos. Like, it's kind of fun to Imagine what if. Okay, I have to start taking weapons now. Great. I should do that. Um. Um, one thing to... One thing in the shop to limit the weapon slots. Just... As a challenge. With all the um, craziness with um, AI and shit lately, maybe it's I really have to wonder about people sometimes, man. It's like, do not understand that art starts with human values. <laughs> the things that you consider in, important in life. In terms of principles and... Things that make life better. to just think about the shortcuts Interesting fight. But yeah, it's this audacious 
lack of integrity is downright shocking with people. It's like they have like zero shame what they're doing. And curse. Okay. A lot of issues that lately of um, just people not having any integrity. And just straight up throwing away the trust people are otherwise have it's just kind of disappointing you know especially when it's happening on the internet one place you People can go and just discover things and talk about whatever. Instead, we got liars and scammers and all that. Frankly, disappointing. Yeah, I don't know why the hell there's <clears throat> this whole. attitude some people have of scam or be scammed but that's the sooner that attitude can be eliminated from civilization itself the better I'm just getting tired of people being like that. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, nice. Elder Tor. I wonder if I wonder if I should get the board game of the same name again. Yeah, it was a Fantasy Flight board game called Elder Torer. It's more... Well, it's the scale of, you know, worldwide mystery solving was comparatively bigger than, you know, Arkham Horror. Just the fact that It kind of streamlined things in a way. But I don't know if that really improved the experience or would have been a detriment. When I had it, I just like more of a solo game for me. I'm out of rerolls. Go lava bucket. 
Bear with me. Hang on there, computer. Oh boy. I still have my notifications on, and I'm thinking, oh dear. like it's okay so I, I like watching who I like to watch at the same time I don't really have a whole lot of time if, if I'm gonna try to do more stuff like uh, content and all that and also uh, sometimes I just want to catch the archive anyway because uh, Live streams are fun and such, but Ooh, nice. Sometimes I just need to be able to pause to take care of other shit. Or head the bathroom. There have been times that I've 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 moved the the stream to my phone and taken it with me to the bathroom because I didn't want to miss anything. Mm. Freaking ranged attack types. Such a pain in the ass. Oh, not the cats. I want to pet them. told me last time. Hey. 
Oh, for fuck's sake, I'm sorry. Uh. Hold on a minute. If I ever move out of here, I'm getting the one room that I can get. I can have my peace and quiet and record whatever the hell I want. Because deep down, I really do want to keep doing this. <laughs> so much for that. Solid. Please go away. Two minute mark. Let's see what the major boss out of this is going to be. The in game achievements thing for this boss shows something interesting. It's like, wait a minute. Whoa. What is this hinting at? <laughs> Freaking out of bounds ranged attackers. I, uh. Oh, see, it's too easy to get caught up on things. Finally. 
cool. <sighs> Had to be sure. Look at all the things in this game. It's like I wonder how many how many people get all the references. <laughs> um, oh, thank goodness! Oh crap! Is this a freak three bosses? I am back on the freaking mountain in Diablo 2 fighting this fight. Hmm. Who remember who's play who here has played Diablo 2 <laughs> with the expansion? Because. Because that's where I feel like I'm at with this. realized how many freaking coins I have. One down. Yeah, two down. Woo! 20,000 coins. Jeez. Not to see if I get the end too. Yes! Woo! <laughs> Made it. Oh, plus. Alright. Sausage! New weapon. <laughs> cool. Alright. Go buy more stuff. I go take care of my house. All right. At some point, I need to come back and um, do the new uh, hard hard stage. I will do that on my own goddamn time. <laughs> Shall probably like.
probably have this on the laptop and a uh, stream on my phone. All right, that was, that's the Hollow Cure update so far. Yeah, I haven't really gotten to do much with the house, but I'm going to go do something with it um, later. I'll have fun with that. It's, it's neat. Every, you know, little fun thing, even if it's not very consequential, it's still... It still adds to the experience, so I'm glad they did a little house, hollow house feature. And I need to go unlock everyone else. So, alright, thanks very much for watching. This has been Pillar, Pillar Nexus Ancient Gladiator. And I'll see you next time. I promise, I promise I will get back to Baldur's Gate too. I'm sorry if we're putting it off. But, we'll get back to it. Alright, see ya.